I'm going to install a new video card from uh, Sapphire. It's uh, HD7870 overclock. And this is one of the really good video cards uh, introduced by Sapphire. You can see box inside the other box. So we have the video card. We have another box here. Uh, let's have a look and see what's there. So we have the driver installation. We have the Molex power to power the video card. We have the two six pins. And we have a quick installation guide as usual. And that's the crossfire. We have a VGA DVI. This is for analog to digital. If you have an old screen, you can have you can use this uh, adapter. And we have the mini uh, HDMI, also another adapter. So we have this uh, Sapphire product uh, registration. So let's take this aside and check the video card. It's a slightly heavy video card and you can see we have two fans and we have four pipes if we look here underneath and you have here where you connect the two six pins uh, power at the back it's the normal uh, circuit board for the video card uh, from Sapphire so this is a standard at the front you can see um, there is this uh, cables to connect the uh, power and basically we have at the back as you see we have the DVI HDMI and two uh, mini HDMI so this is going to be installed into this PC I'm going to install it to this ASUS motherboard as you see so it can fit easily without any problem inside this way so basically I just need to take this uh, cable and tie them at the back we have the 6 pins to power uh, cable coming from the power supply so I don't need to use the extra comes with the video card I'm just sliding this in that's it so the video card is in now and now I just have to put the power so as you see it's uh, very simple it's installed I just finished the installation of the software driver let's see the device manager this is Windows 7 as you see ultimate so it's familiar for some of you and you can see the video HD7800 so it's installed and we have the resolution set up so it's all good thank you for watching this video I will see you soon take care